Good morning, everyone. Well, with 20 billion minutes of voice and video on the Agora network, developers like yourself trust Agora to deliver the highest quality voice and video over the internet. Uh, now, that's, e that's not easy. Um, you know, it should just work. It doesn't matter where user, where they are, what's the devices they're using, or what's their network condition. Uh, that's a challenge for many of your developers. Uh, so what we, uh, what we want to offer to all the developers is a dependable quality of experience for developers to build your application all the way from the cloud to edge devices. Now, one of the key pieces of this computing fabric is the software-defined real-time network from Agora. Uh, with 200 data centers around the world, now you have a global coverage, a truly global coverage, with high performance, high availability, without the need to pay for dedicated lines. Now, having the global network is not just about you know, SDRTN. Now, it's also our engineering team continuously investing and updating with the algorithm to make our SDRTN smarter, uh, more adaptive, more scalable, and more resilient to network conditions. Now, don't take my word for it. Uh, we, I'm going to show you a side-by-side -side test to show a simple sample application running on the Agora SDK against two competitors. Uh, and then you can see how it performs as the network condition deteriorates. Uh, now, for the fun of it, we also throw in Facebook, uh, FaceTime, um, so, uh, so you can see how it compares with FaceTime as well. Let's play the video. Great, thanks to SCRTN, uh, you can see from the video, even at 60% packet loss, the video app running the Agora SDK is still running smoothly. So that's pretty good. Um, and and you know, we, we really believe that's what the, the value we're delivering today. Uh, and that's why many developers trust Agora. Um, but we think we can be better. Uh, so uh, we are continuously investing in the network. Uh, with the next generation of SCRTN that we'll be releasing very soon, uh, we're actually gonna, you're going to see even more dramatic improvement on video quality. Uh, in fact, uh, I'm going to invite Sik Sharma, uh, developer of uh, developer relations from Agora, to give us a live demo. Come and join us. Hey, Virginia, how's it going? Great, great. How are you doing? Good, good. Well, thanks for uh, allowing me to help you with this demo. Uh, so let's get to it. Um, we'll go ahead and start a FaceTime call. All righty. Well, now that the AV is working, you guys can see me. Hey, guys. Uh, so this stream is actually uh, you know, not great quality. It looks like it's 240p. You can't really see a crisp and uh, you know, smooth image. Uh, it's not really up to scale. So let's actually go ahead and activate the super resolution model on the local device. And let's activate it now. And boom, I'm going to turn it off and on, off and on, off and on. So as you can see, it's uh, able to make the image more crisp, more clear, and actually this is all happening on the local device. Let's actually check it out how it performs with some text. So here's my handy dandy adapter. So this is off and on, off and on. One more time, off and on. Can you see it? Great. Cool. So yeah, as you guys can see, you know, when it's off, it's um, not not so clear, and when it's on, it's it's very cr crystal clear. I'm gonna try to use the low clear, low resolution version for my next Tinder picture. It doesn't look it, it doesn't look too good for the super resolution on me. And this again is all, all thanks to this uh, amazing model that uh, our R&D team has gone ahead and uh, launched, and it's available on iOS now. And um, back to you, Virginia. Great. Thank you. So let's cut back to the PowerPoint. Thank you. Great. I know it's, uh, it's really risky to do a live demo. So. Uh, now, so we talk about 
So we talk about the SDRTN, and then we talk about machine learning on edge devices. Um, so now let's talk a little bit about how we're evolving our platform uh, to make those innovation flexible building blocks for your developers. Uh, so we, you know, one of the main res revolutions that we had is that what if we decouple the media engine from transport uh, and made the transport engine available to those developers who want to build their own engine. In fact, uh, I think many of the WebRTC developers want to build their own, um, you know, your own media engine. And so what if you use that and, and then we combine the power of SDRTN uh, to enable some real cool use cases. Uh, and so that's the approach that, that we're taking. Uh, in fact, uh, one other benefit of this approach um, is that we actually now can enable some really unique experiences that's not possible before. For example, in live broadcasting use cases, uh, now we can enable zero time switching and also channel merging in the live broadcasting use case uh, to allow you to have real, real, real fast experience, a real interactive experience. And all of that thanks to the SDRTN edge server for media preprocessing, um, using the combination of the client technology and the cloud technology coming together. Uh, so let's have Sid try the final demo. Alrighty. All right. <laughs> Well, great. So uh, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys this demo, but I want to put you guys in the right spot. Imagine your favorite live music, live music uh, video type of app. Let's take Musical.ly, for example. Sometimes, you know, when I'm on Musical.ly, I want to listen to Bollywood music. I'm really in my feels at that time. You know, I'm, I'm in that romantic mood. But then sometimes I'm, I'm going out and partying, and uh, I want to listen to some rap music. Uh, but you know, when I'm jumping from Bollywood to rap, the, 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 the experience isn't really seamless. You know? It takes some time for it to load. Uh, I have to go find it, and then it buffers. It, it's not really, it doesn't keep me enticed to, to stay on the app. Uh, I actually want to go ahead and say, you know what, I'm just going to go ahead and listen to Spotify. So with this uh, next demo, I'm going to be showing you the ability for zero time switch. Now I can jump from rap to Bollywood with no latency whatsoever. So let's go ahead and get started. And boom, there's Jake, my favorite <laughs> Bollywood lip syncer. He is getting his dance moves on, you know, getting all the Bollywood motions going. And with that, with just one click, I'm in a different channel watching my favorite East Coast rapper, Hermes, spit it out. And it's, I can go back and forth, back and forth, and voila. And now, you know, this, these flexible building blocks allow you to create unique experiences that are not, never seen before in apps. And it allows you, you know, that the possibilities are really endless. Back to you, Virginia. Can I see the switching again? Can you try to switch back Boom. and forth? There's my favorite Bollywood singer. Can you try and to here's my favorite it's rapper. Really fast. It's okay. really fast. Yep, no latency whatsoever. OK, awesome. Great, great. Thank you so much. All right. And um, just to let you guys know, we are actually uh, going to be demoing these at our Ask the Developer booth. If you have any questions, I know the first demo we weren't really able to see without the uh, presentation, but I would be glad to show you guys that we have plenty of people at the Ask the Developer booth. So please do come by and ask any questions, and we'll demo this again for you uh, at the booth. Back to you. Great. Awesome. Thank you, Sid. Thanks. And and, and with that, I want to conclude the welcome keynote. So thank you again for being here today. Um, and Tony, Reggie, and myself, and, and Sid, and the rest of the Agora crew will be out there at the Ask the Expert and the Agora booth. Just come talk to us. If you have any questions about the things that you've seen today. Uh, and also thank you to all the sponsors. Uh, we couldn't have this event without you. So thank you. Please check out the, the sponsor booth as well. So thank you. I have a great conference. Thank you.